You're the inspector. Put yourself in the inspector's shoes. Pass or fail, first of all. And then we're going to talk about major key code points. That's a notch of a piece of blocking. That was a support for that panned out bay. It was a non-structural support. The clamps look like they're right. They look like the right PVC to cast iron clamps. And then the clamps in between the, the cast iron look good too. Uh, it has a nail guard up top with the PVC coming across. It's a clean out. I mean, it looks good. Caught everything. You got a nail guard up there. Those are proper clamps transitioning from cast iron to PVC. Notice we didn't insert PVC here because you can't. You have to be inserting cast iron within cast iron. We're talking about two huge differences in material expansion and contraction. So that was pretty good. Is that load bearing or no? I don't believe it was load bearing. I believe it was an inside partition. So the hole took out more than one third of the timber. Therefore, it would have needed some type of engineered piece of metal that a company called Simpson makes. And they actually make them for plumbers who, when they drill holes through load bearing walls, you can actually put these pieces over there to make sure that all the weight is transferred the way it's supposed to be. This overall job was really, really nice. You know what? I can be a real pain in the ass on jobs as a local inspector or a previous local inspector. But no, this was a pass. This was really, really good. This was actually really nice. <laughs>